So we got here a manual, the Voxnail GT camera kit, which is similar to the HD Pro. Actually, this is an HD Pro camera, and we got a small fan on top, which is soldered on the 5 volts out. It looks like a similar pattern is by the Voxnail Moonlight, and our stock antenna. In the box, you also have a set of screws and um, JSTSH connectors, some plastic tabs for the SD card. The dimensions of the housing seems to be 34 millimeters by 34 millimeters, and thickness is around 20 millimeters, including the fan assembly. The GT seems to use the same Avatar Sky firmware as we have used in the V2 VTX units. Before we attach the SD card mounting tab, we have to clean the SD card surface first. And this will hold tight. When inserting the SD card, just make sure that the SD card is inserted deeply into the socket. Use the pull out tab to remove the SD card from the slot. Okay, so the weight of the kit, excluding the camera lens cover, is 41 grams. Let's put it side by side with the Moonlight kit. Uh, you see that the Moonlight is uh, a bit thicker, but with the inclusion of the fan, the GT seems to be taller. So here's the GT installed and uh, as you can see I added a 12 volt back along the line because my flight controller is about 2 feet from this VTX unit so there's a lot of voltage drop going on along the way so I have used this back to step it down from 6S to 12 volts you also have to consider the airflow from this fan is pushing towards this heat sink and not sucking the air out so make sure that when you install it under the canopy or inside the fuselage, the air intake should not be interfering with the flow of air from this fan. In the shadows of my dreams where the sun really shines, I walk this lonely road.